I'm Dr. Safi Karim and today I'm going to show you how to complete a bowel cancer screening kit by using the simple methods 1, 2 and 3. 1. It's about you. 2. It's about your number 2's. And 3. You have to do it 3 times in a week and it takes less than 3 minutes. So let's consider these steps in a little bit more detail. First of all, number 1. It's about you. And if you're aged between 60 and 74, you are at increased risk of bowel cancer. This is why the NHS sends you a kit in the post every two years to check if you have the early signs of cancer. Two, it's about your number two. Okay, you might call this a poo or a bowel motion. As I'm a medic, I'm gonna call it a sample. If you happen to have cancer in your bowel from time to time, it bleeds, and that's what we're measuring. And three, you repeat this test three times as cancer doesn't bleed every day. I'd recommend you get the test done within a week and send it back in the post as you have a 14 days to complete the kit and return it. Okay, let's have a look and see what you need. In the post you will have received an orange and white test card, a strip of cardboard sticks, a free post envelope and an instruction leaflet. You'll also find you'll need a pen, some plastic gloves, a container, something to wrap up the waste when you've finished. And I'm going to explain how easy it is for you to do the test. Remember one, two and three. So one is you and two, you know when you're going to do a number two. So remember the things you need, that's these things here, and write the date on the first tab. Now to make sure you collect the sample in the tray and don't let it fall in, in the toilet as that could affect the accuracy of the test results. I have a sample here. Now when you're ready, open the tab and break off the first stick. Collect a piece from the side of the sample and lightly smear it onto the first window, then put that stick aside. Now take another fresh stick and do the same again from a different area of the sample and lightly smear it onto the second window, then put your stick aside and close the tab. Make sure you store the kit in a cool, dry place until your next number two. Over the next few days, you'll do this exercise two more times, each time completing two windows under each tab. Double check you've written a date on each tab, put it into the free post envelope and pop it in the post. You'll get the results back in two or three weeks and there will be one of three outcomes. First, the results could be unclear and you may need to do the test again. It could be abnormal and you will be invited to go to the hospital for further tests. Do not be alarmed, as other minor conditions can also cause bleeding. However, if it is cancer, hopefully it's an early cancer and you have a very high chance of a cure. Finally, in the majority of cases, it will be normal and you will be offered another free opportunity to have a bowel cancer screening in two years' time until the age of 74. However, if you find you can't do a number two because you have constipation, diarrhea, a mixture of the two, or bleeding from the bowel, make sure you see your GP before you complete the kit. One, two, three is straightforward, but if you make a mistake, don't worry, as you can call the number on the bottom of the screen for a new kit. In the UK, the NHS is gaining ground over bowel cancer, and thanks to your help, we are catching cancer early. So if you receive the kit through the post, don't ignore it. This little piece of cardboard could save your life.